Arrivals at Bengaluru airport from some states, of course, will have to go straight into quarantine. There are buses which are taking them to the institutional quarantine for seven days. And where, where have you come from? I'm coming from Delhi. And heading to quarantine? Yes. Yeah, she's six months pregnant. Pregnant women, there is an allowance actually to have yes. home quarantine. But they are not allowing us. I just showed the documents also. Yes, yes. But they are not allowing me. It's, it's a six months pregnant lady. And I'm just waiting from the last five hours. Really? Yes. But that, that is so strange because there is a clear allowance for people over 80, children under 10 and for pregnant women as well. Yes. Wait, what time did, what time did you reach it from Delhi? The government is not doing good. You know about the financial problems facing everyone, right? And they are just uh, they are demanding the rooms like 2,000 per room, you should have to be taken. Otherwise you will just quarantine here, yeah, maybe you just go out. What is the hell? I'm just very, totally very fed up. Very difficult. Very yes. Difficult. What time did your flight arrive from Delhi? Uh, it's around uh, 9 o'clock it will be arrived. So you've already been here for several hours then? Yes. How, how, how are you feeling? How, how is she? She's not feeling well. Even she doesn't take any food and also. Oh, that, that's so strange because pregnant women are supposed yeah. to be allowed. Do you, do you have a home here? You have a home here? No, I, I do uh -huh. work over there only. Yes. Yeah, I just came here for some for my work only. For work? Okay. Yes. All right. Yeah. And you have to head into quarantine. Yeah. Thank you so much. Your name is? My name is Saurabh Gonyal. Thank you, Saurabh. Thank you very much. And I, I hope things are sorted out soon, really. So people here who have to head into quarantine being taken over there. Those are the buses that are taking them to the institutional quarantine for seven days, which is compulsory. If after that they test negative, they can go to home quarantine for seven days. These are people who are arriving from Delhi, Madhya Pradesh, Rajasthan and of course Maharashtra, Gujarat, Tamil Nadu, the states with the highest number of cases. People arriving from other states also have to head to quarantine but it can be 14 days home quarantine. But this young pregnant woman also being asked to head into quarantine. And so, so this child is excited about going to a hotel room. <laughs> You're heading to quarantine. She, the little one seems excited. <laughs> where, where have you come from? <laughs> so the child excited, the family certainly not excited about not being allowed to go home. Not excited at all. <laughs> Which city have you come from? <laughs> Which city have you come from? Rajasthan. Rajasthan. Jaipur. So con quarantine is compulsory, institutional quarantine. Yeah, they put in special quarantine for, with the kids uh, because the kid is five years and uh, okay. daughter is ten years so old. Special quarantine. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So one week there, then one week at home if you test negative. Right. Yeah. Right. Thank you so much. Well, all the best to you. So Rajasthan, Delhi, people from these states having to go into compulsory seven-day institutional quarantine, followed by home quarantine if they test negative. So on the first day of domestic air travel. For many people, it's not about straight going home. With Jane Kumar, Maya Sharma in Bengaluru for NDTV. So the young couple who had arrived from Delhi, yeah. so I'm, I'm, you're going I'm again, back? again going back to the Delhi. Going back to Delhi? Yes, ma'am. I'm very fed up of this, ma'am. Seriously, no one respect us. Ma'am, everyone knows about the financial condition and all this thing. Uh -huh. But they are not giving the respect to anyone. Okay. They are just telling to, if you want to go, you can go back. So that's why I'm going with. So you're going back. You yeah, flew in from Delhi this morning, but, answer, but your no wife is money. pregnant and you yes, cannot afford the. Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, if everything will be happen, then definitely I will blame on the police staffs only. If everything will be get happen, because my wife is very empty. Okay, she doesn't eat any single food over there. She hasn't eaten anything so no. far. Yes. Six months pregnant, but she hasn't eaten yes. anything. Oh my! You must have started very early in the morning. Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, I just uh, came back around four o'clock in the morning, and around uh, now it's. Uh, uh, one o'clock maybe I think she doesn't eat anything ma'am ma'am that is not fair for me so you're going back to Delhi yes, okay, all the very best have okay, a safe journey and all the best to your wife as well so this young couple they landed from Delhi traveled from Delhi early in the morning on the first day of domestic travel allowed in India his wife six months pregnant they were told they had to go into compulsory quarantine they're saying it's just too expensive and they're turning right round and heading back to Delhi once again people from six states of course have to go compulsorily into quarantine whether it's delhi madhya pradesh rajasthan or the states with the highest prevalence maharashtra gujarat and tamil Nadu. and this young couple not lucky on their very first day of travel
the day domestic travel was allowed in India by air once again. Back again with Saurabh, you decided you would want to fly back to Delhi. What's yeah. the latest now? No, actually the flight will be not available today itself. Okay. So I've just decided to go in the morning, tomorrow morning. Okay. I will go. You're going because in the they are not listening to my reasons and all. So what, what should I do? My wife is pregnant, so I will do anything so now, for them. Now you're heading in the bus yeah. to the quarantine. Yes, hotel. yes. And trying to fly back tomorrow. Yes, I will fly back tomorrow. Yeah. Difficult but, situation. Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, they are not listening, listening to anyone. And how they are behaving with the peoples, I know very well. One of the ladies, she is uh, sitting uh, in the airport only that time. And I think four or five people, uh, policemen. They just like, uh, that will be not good. If I think this, if you are giving the rates like 2000, 3000, a Very difficult. Yes, ma'am, it's very difficult for us. Thank you so much. So, Saurabh, one example of the difficulties being faced by passengers, they arrived from Delhi. They decided to go back to Delhi, but with no flights available today, he's having to go into quarantine for that one night, but determined to head back yes, to Delhi tomorrow. Not because they are just uh, giving the uh, uh, transportation fees, hotel charges fees, dinner fees, lunch fees. So, ma'am, everything if we are given, so government... How much government is it huh? How much is it coming to? Ma'am, 3,000 rupees per day. They are just telling. Ma'am, it's a very big amount it's for, a big amount. It's a big for amount. everyone. Yes, ma'am. So, he wants to head back to Delhi. No flights back to Delhi today, but he will go tomorrow. With DM Kumar, Maya Sharma in Bengaluru Airport for NDTV.